you guys are you guys just gonna be in our business while we shoot? Hi. Are you done? Are you leaving? Can I help you? Can I help you though? I started early. Oh. I don't know if it even picked you up doing your Palpatine or whatever. <laughs> okay. Steven is currently setting up a time-lapse camera in a different spot because now we are actually going to record putting together a bunch of prefab furniture. Which you can see here next to Zoom the dino dog who's just staring at me because he doesn't want to be in the room. He wants to be upstairs where he can hunt for food when he's not supposed to be hunting for food. He's got a counter surfing problem we're trying to break him up. It's not going well. But the wall is up, the wall is clean-ish. We have to redo some of the stains on one of the squares, but eh, could be worse. But thanks to our wonderful patrons and people who have bought things on Etsy, we can afford some shelving to put toys on, which you've seen before, but also some storage cubes, which will actually make up the legs of the table we're going to build which is the last step, I think, other than figuring out lighting. Because if you watched our mail video, our lighting's not there yet. But we'll get it there. We just have to figure out how. Oh, and we also have to set up Steven's map, which was the background of the old set, and we like it, so we're keeping it. Yeah. Though, have you figured out how you're going to... Not even a little. Hang it. Okay. I think I need to know where the table is first. Okay. Because then I know where I'm Oh, sitting. no, I thought, I meant, um, have you figured out, like, just general placement of the triangles to each other? Is it going to be the oh, same? Oh, it's going to or... be roughly the same. I mean, there's only so many arrangements that you can have because, you know, you have to have the continents match up to where they exist. Yeah. But, no, I, I, I'm leaning towards having Western Hemisphere on one wall and uh -huh. eastern hemisphere on the other wall. Y you went the exact wrong way for me to smoothly move with you. <laughs> we'll get used to this again. Okay, um, because if I recall correctly, there's no, you, you can't just arrange them nice and, and neat in, in rows and have it make sense as a map. Uh-huh. Isn't that right? Those, yeah, see, cause if I if I put it like this, now it looks like a continent. Uh-huh. Whereas if I split it up, now you're like, wait, that's that's North America. <laughs> so 
so I can lie, essentially, because that's North America, so this should be over here. Ah. Uh -huh. So you're going to have fun trying to figure it out, is what you're saying. Probably. <laughs> but we're going to finish setting up, and then you'll be seeing more time lapse of us putting together furniture, which, you know, enjoy. <laughs>
And then we lucked out with the lighting. That's true. All we did for the lighting right now, well, I got to do the third one, but um, all we're doing to light the set is dropping down the the bar. These are LEDs, actually. Lights. Yes. I wanted to say fluorescent, but they're not fluorescent. Um, and that gives us a decent amount of light. Like, the show is not traditionally lit. Like, we don't do three-point lighting. We don't uh, control the light very well. well we and it's say, also super flat. You say we should say traditional by film standards. Oh, by film, yeah. Because by broadcast standards, I think fluorescents or LEDs are the standard now. To do pretty True. flat Every, lighting. Well, everything television is so overlit anyway. But yeah. yeah. And then we have the table, which isn't technically done, but it's done enough for the next episode. Yeah. I feel like we need to put something on it to keep it from doing this. Yeah, I'll figure out some bracing. I'm probably going to paint the top, even though I like the color that it is. Uh, it needs more of a finished look to it. We can probably find a color close to it and paint. But also, there's already like scratches and scuffs on it. Yeah, that's my fault. I was doing some of our Etsy work and fulfilling orders on this table. For shame. Yeah, I know. This table is just about rated for plastic dinosaurs. If I put like three more plastic dinosaurs on it, it would probably fall over. <laughs> uh, I may be surprised it's as stable as it is because I knew that using cube shelves as legs when it's just fiber fill all right. the way through was dicey to begin with. This is true. But I wanted something cheap and functional enough for you because you like to have your iPad and water and stuff with you. This is true. I'm not sure exactly how that's going to work. I, I, I practiced extensively, but I have not practiced on the set and I really need to do that. Yeah. I think I'm just going to have the iPad in my lap. Yeah, but if you ever want to set it aside, that's what the shelves are for. Gotcha. We could make like a little bracket to hang from this table or something too if we wanted. Yeah. Well, I need to be able to grab it because as you know, I can't keep more than, you know, six lines of notes in my head <laughs> at any one time. Yeah. I suppose always... I could just write it out on cue cards. Maybe. I mean, we could figure card. out something with the other board of MDF that we bought because neither of us could actually like hold dimensions in our head when we were sitting there at our big, local big box store staring at panels. Yeah, we were, we weren't, we didn't think that one panel would be wide enough, but they, this was the minimum size that they came in. But if you put two together, that's about the width of the room. So that wasn't going to work either. Yeah, both of us needed more coffee that day, I think. That seems likely. So that's been a very short look at building the set, and when this video goes out, we are actually going to announce to the patrons when we are shooting the first of the new episodes, which is still Velociraptor, um, because as thank you for all of your support when we were clearly just starting over from scratch and not putting a lot of stuff out we want to show our thanks and just let you hang out with us while we figure out how we're doing the new episode and actually getting it going. So yeah. Got anything else to add, Steven? Wow, this is hard to do. There we go. <laughs> really? Alright. Uh, again, thank you to everyone who has been so supportive. We'll see you guys next time.